is a serious warning to anyone who's not received Jesus as Lord and Saviour. R. Murray McShane, a godly Scottish minister, hearing that a friend of the family had said that she was determined to keep by the world, in other words, reject Jesus and the gospel, he wrote the following lines on her melancholy decision. She hath chosen the world and its paltry crowd. She hath chosen the world and an endless shroud. She hath chosen the world with its misnamed pleasures. She hath chosen the world before heaven's own treasures. She hath launched her boat on life's giddy sea, and her all is afloat for eternity. But Bethlehem's star is not in her view, and her aim is far above far from the harbour through. When the storm descends from the angry sky, ah, where from the winds shall the vessel fly? When stars are concealed and rudder gone, and heaven is sealed to the wandering one, the whirlpool opes for the gallant prize, and with all her hopes to the deep she hies. But who may tell of the place of woe where the wicked dwell, where the whirlwind go? For the human heart can ne'er conceive what joys are the part of them who believe. Nor can justly think of the cup of death which all must drink who despise the faith. Away then, O oh, fly from the joys of earth. Her smile is a lie. The smile of the earth, that is, is a lie. There's a sting in her mirth. Come, leave the dreams of this transient night and bask in the bee of an endless light. Hebrews chapter 2 verse 3 says this, How shall we escape if we neglect so great a salvation? Jesus is the Saviour. Receive him today as your Lord and Saviour.